Let us solve this question. Find the equation of circles each having radius 5 when touching the line at 0.1 comma 2. Which means we have a line. The equation of this line is given. And this line is touching the circle. It means the line is a common tangent to both of these circles. And these two circles having the radius 5 units each. So this is the condition. So the radius is given. If you want to find the equation of circle, you need to get the center coordinate of the center. How will you get the coordinate of the center? Now assume that this particular circle having the center as the origin. Let it be. The circle is having the center as the origin. Now we can take a tangent. Mm, this will be the tangent. Now if you draw a point draw a line from origin to the tangent it will be perpendicular because tangent is always perpendicular to the radius similarly the other circle will be like this with the radius 5 units now if you have a circle with the center as origin how will you represent a point x comma y in terms of radius and theta parametric form parameter theta x coordinate will be r cos theta and y coordinate will be r sin theta hmm. now how will you conclude these points are collinear radius is perpendicular to tangent radius is perpendicular to tangent in that sense these three points will form, lie on same line which are collinear now if i complete this To form two triangles. I am making this as two triangles. Hmm? If this angle is theta, the inclination of this radius with the x-axis is theta, this angle will be also theta. Since this are, these two angles are 90 degree, this angle will be 90 minus theta and this angle will be 90 minus theta. Since this radius is 5 units or r units, this is also r units because two circles will have the same radius. Which means these two triangles are identical or which are congruent. If this point is having a coordinate of x comma y, which means this particular distance will be x units and this particular distance will be y units. Since this is x unit, this will be also equal to x units and this will also be equal to y units, which means if this point is x comma y, this point will be having x plus x, 2x as its x coordinate and 2y as its y coordinate. Now, have you noticed something? From this point, if you add x and y, x and y with corresponding coordinate, for example, this coordinate has, this coordinate has, this point has the equation, has the um, coordinates x comma y. If you add x and y, you will get the center of other circle. If you subtract x and y, you will get the center of the other circle. Which means, if this point is, instead of x comma y, if this is 1 comma 2, let this point be 1 comma 2. If this point is 1 comma 2, if this point is 1 comma 2, if you add x and y, you will get the center of the circle, which is which will be 1 plus x comma 2 plus y. If you add x and y, x with x coordinate and y with y coordinate you will get the center if you subtract x, x and y you will get the center it will be 1 minus x comma y minus x which will be 2 minus y if you subtract x comma y you will get this point if you add x comma y you will get this point now how will you represent x and y in terms of theta and r it will be 1 plus r cos theta comma 2 plus r sin theta similarly this will be 1 minus r cos theta comma 2 minus r sin theta since the radius of circle is given it is equal to 5 units 5 units here it is 5 units it is also 5 units now how will you get the value of theta since this theta is the inclination of this line the line joining the center to center line, line joining the centers of the circle. 
Since this theta is the inclination of this line with the x axis, what is the inclination of this tangent? This tangent will be 3x plus 4y plus 11 equal to 0. Minus 11 equal to 0. What is the slope of this tangent? y equal to minus 3 by 4x plus 11. If you write y equal to mx plus c, this slope of the tangent will be, slope of the tangent will be equal to minus 3 by 4. We know that slope of normal in the slope of tangent equal to minus 1, which means slope of normal will be negative reciprocal of slope of tangent, which will be 4 by 3. What is 4 by 3 slope of this normal? Which means tan theta equal to 4 by 3. If tan theta equal to 4 by 3 means, if you draw a similar triangle, if this angle is theta means tan theta will be opposite side will be adjacent side, which means when you apply Pythagoras theorem, this will be automatically become pi units, the hypotenuse. How will you get sin theta? Sin theta will be equal to, sin theta will be equal to opposite side divided by hypotenuse. Similarly, cos theta will be equal to adjacent side divided by hypotenuse. Now you will get the center points. What is the center of the circle? C1. Let, it, let us call this one C1. C1 will be equal to 1 plus 5 into what is the value of cos theta? 3 by 5, comma 2 plus 5 into what is the value of sin theta? 4 by 5. This will be 4 and 6 respectively. Similarly, this will be 1 minus 5. What is the value of cos theta? 3 by 5, comma 2 minus 5 into 4 by 5 sin theta. This will be minus 2 comma minus 2 respectively. Which means this circle is having a center of minus 2 comma minus 2. This will have a center of 4 comma 6. Now how will you find the equation? x minus h the whole square plus y minus kd whole square equal to r square is the general formula of a circle with center hk. In this case, the radius is 5 units, which means r square will be 25. Now we can substitute the value, which will be minus 2 comma minus 2. It will be x plus 2 the whole square plus y plus 2 the whole square equal to 25. Similarly, if you substitute this value, x minus 4 the whole square plus y minus 6 the whole square is equal to 25. This is how you will get the equation of those two circles. Assume that the circle starts with the origin. Then later you need to compare with the base concept with the given condition in the question. Change the point, initially change this point. When this point is already changed, it is clear that now this point is no longer be the origin. Then you need to find the coordinate of these two points. If this point is origin, this is the relation. That same relation will be validating even the circle line somewhere in this xy coordinate plane. 